they're going to do the MDVA special for Smashville. So let's see how this game goes. Alright. First left is made already. Okay. Jabbing and getting them off the stage. Getting a little charge here and there. Just trying to make sure he gets some type of limit. Oh my gosh. Foul is not winning. He is not being patient. He wants to get in there, get that damage, get right back up. But um so far Vash is pulling away with this lead that he has here. Already getting him up to about 80%. And climbing. Ooh, that was a read for Clara Slash right there. Yeah, sniffed it out already. Put up the shield just enough time so he doesn't get that stock taken. Alright, so at this point, Vash can just chill back, collect limit, do whatever he wants at this point. Like, Ooh, nice paper ground coming through. A lot of damage, big damage coming through. 39%. Bash playing the waiting game. Not wanting to overextend and getting that stock stolen by the Bow Wow. <laughs> Alright, Crossless taking it right there. Good call out by Vash. Alright, but definitely needs to be careful here. Bowser can rack up a lot of damage, and then he always has that throw up air. The Bow Wow can always throw stocks super early. Okay, getting a couple up tilts, lifting on him. Already got him 40 damage. Still climbing. Nice. Aggressive bear. Getting him on stage there. Ooh. Oh, wow. That's just going to take his stock. Sometimes you just got to put the booty on him. All right, though. But Vest still has the lead here. And he can definitely take this stock clean and early. And then quick. So, Foul needs to be careful with his back air and every hitbox he can throw out. Like it's still stocks early. Oh my gosh, calling him out. Ooh, put him down. Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Forest Man is just going to take that. Yeah, the booty didn't work that time. Yeah. Might need to put that booty away, so. Got you killed twice now. Alright, so not changing characters here. Just going to stick with the characters they already have. See where they're gonna go. Town and city. All right, so this could be a double-edged sword for foul. Although he may be able to kill earlier with Bowser, Vash can do the same and probably kill much earlier than Bowser with limit. Since cross slash and finishing touch and everything else is just extremely powerful in this matchup. Just up tilting away. Already we're getting in the 34. So far, Vash is just using these platforms, charging limit. And then once he gets limited, just going right back down into the fight. Uses his movements. A good pivot grab by Foul there. Racking up the damage. Okay. Come down with the down air. Another grab coming through. Alright, he's approaching that percentage now. And now that he has limit on, it definitely makes him heavier so he can get hit with the setup. But um, so far, they're pretty much even in percentages here. Nice back air. Getting the weak spot, not the strong. Okay. Get up attack. It's bold. Up air? Yep. That's going to be that first stock there. So, foul. Coming with the lead this time in this game, too. He definitely has rage to boot, so if he just plays his cards right and be patient, this match could be over real quick. But um, while Vash doesn't have limit, he probably should push his advantage while he can. Oh, the platform. Oh, that's, that's wow. That sucks. That sucks. I think Vash was trying to um, up B while the platform was like right next to the edge to catch the edge, but it pulled out as soon as he hit up B and that caused him to basically SD. So, it's going to be game two. Let's see what Vash counter pick is going to be. Lilat? So, we're going to Lilat, the jankiest stage of them all. Do not like the stage, but... Let's see what they can do. So, game three here. Alright, same plan. Not really changing up that much. Just playing out on the platforms, getting his limit where he can. Yep. 
Yeah, that, that was definitely unsafe right there. Getting caught by that cross flash from doing that there. Okay, dash attack. That shouldn't still the stock to shot, but it's good damage. For dash. Ooh. Nice back air. That was sending him at a weird angle there. Grab. Forward though, just getting right back off the stage again. Charge limit. Wow. <laughs> he couldn't go for a very long time. He didn't even try to challenge him. But um, so far, Bash is basically has this gigantic lead that he has here. He can just play his game and whatever he wants at this point. Probably an up air or a back air will still the stock. And trading with that down B, still going to take the stock there about Bash. Ooh, okay, up smash. Tell him he's not safe on top of that platform. All right, so it looks like Fowl is looking for a pivot grab here. Get some high damage in and then go for his token frame that everyone knows and loves. Okay. Hey, that's just playing the matchup. He's just standing up on top of the platforms. He does not want to be on ground. That might actually be it. Yeah, that, that's going to be it. So, Fowl evening this up. So, we're down to lax stock here on this game three. So, down to the wire here. Ooh. Not just yet. He definitely needs to be careful. Like, oh, wow. Air dodge right through it. That could have been a ton of damage that he caught from that. But, um, so far, Vest is just taking his hits, running away with this lead as much as he can. All right, well, that's a grab. It's a neutral air. Ton of damage. 48 already on Vest. But he does have limit, and cross slash will steal the stock if he's not careful. So, Foul needs to play careful. Needs to play his cross rate. Good roll. But that down smash is going to take that stock. So good stuff to Bash. Taking that game from up. So 2-1 there for Bash.